Hi there. Uh, today I wanted to talk about imagination and what is imagination. And, you know, it's one of those things that, that you look at as, it, you know, it not being real. Um, but I want to challenge that thinking. I mean, it essentially, uh, it is, a, it, obviously it is a something that we all do. And uh, essentially, it, it, is a, it is a real ability um, because it has real-life beneficial effects. Um, you know, if you go to one of one of those classes where you know as you're trying to improve yourself, one of the first steps that they're ever going to tell you is you need to imagine your goals. Well, why do you need to do that if you know if imagine, imagination you know is essentially you know nothing? You know, it's just you think about it. You know, because it because it works because it uh, has real life beneficial effect. Um, I mean. It, all of our technology was all imagined by someone and then they made it into a reality. We wouldn't have any technology if somebody didn't imagine it. So, you know, I, I mean, I, I woke up in the morning and I'm just thinking about this and, you know, I'm thinking about all these things about uh, imagination. I mean, it essentially, is, you know, it's an inherent part of consciousness. But, you, you know, you, you can't even think of not having imagination. I mean, can you imagine not imagining? I mean, it's an essential part of what you are. And, uh, you know, I, I'm, I'm just just thinking about all of these things, you know, where, where it's, you know, you can even, you can't stop yourself from being able to imagine, and because it is what you are, but you can block off uh, things that you can imagine. I mean, you know, belief systems. They essentially kind of block your imagination ability. I mean, if you ever, you know, if you believe something, then you won't be able to see somebody else's point of view. You won't be able to imagine it because your beliefs block you from doing that. But you know, it's it's blocking you from an ability that you have. Uh, so I mean, I, I don't know. It's just you know, a quick little. Uh, I wanted to make a quick little video about this, really challenging uh, people's thinking on imagination. About it, you know, it, it it is a real ability, just like seeing and hearing and everything else. And uh, uh, I mean. You know, it can't be a product of the brain. I mean, can it? I mean, I've never heard of somebody getting brain damage and then not being able to imagine. I mean, you wouldn't be able to function if you can't imagine. So, so if it's separate from brain, you know, essentially, and and essentially, imagination is something that's non-physical, but having physical results. Um, so again, kind of random rant here about this, but it was something that I thought of in the morning, and I, I, I just started, my brain just started thinking about these things, and I'm, I'm even still thinking about it and, and wondering. So if anybody has anything to add to it, I'd, I'd be happy to hear them. Um, anyway, that's it. Uh, take care, you know, and uh, talk to you next time.